my favorite part. Oh yeah. See the change engine oil soon light did come on. All right, we wanna check our oil on our 2022 convertible C8. Now, it does not have the exposed mid-engine like the coupe does, so let's kind of walk through the steps on how to do that. With our handy dandy remote, we're gonna hit the lock button one time, hold down, we're gonna tap the uh, convertible top part twice and hold it down. Wow, okay, now what's up? Your oil stick. Pull that up there. There you go, fold that over out of the way. And here you are. Got your oil stick, so we're gonna check the oil, find out uh, how low it is, if it's where it's supposed to be at. But I wanted you to see how to open the top up. Again, let's look at the remote again. With the remote, you hit the lock button once, tap once on the convertible opener, and on the second tap, hold it down. Let's take a look at the owner's manual and, and see what the owner's manual says about how to check the oil on this particular car. Go into My Chevrolet, go into the owner's manual here, we could go by categories. Uh, let's just type in oil. Get straight to the point. Engine oil pressure light, engine oil life system. Let's do engine oil life system. Okay, the vehicle has a computer that indicates when to change the engine oil filter. And it's based on several combinations, obviously, engine temperature, miles driven, several different things that you can kind of read here. So it tells you here, uh, the vehicle has a racetrack ready dry sump engine lubrication system. This high performance system operates differently than a standard engine lubrication system and requires a special procedure when changing the engine oil and filter okay so we're not going to just jack this car up in your driveway and and do it the old traditional way so when the system has calculated the engine oil has been diminished it indicates a light that oil change is necessary a change engine oil soon message comes on change the oil as soon as possible within the next uh 600 miles if it is possible my favorite part oh yeah see the change engine oil soon light did come on now for this particular car to check the oil it it says i mean you can look on the on the dipstick it says to check the oil uh with a warm engine while the car is at idle it's actually on the dipstick you can see that for yourself so we're going to back this car out of the driveway and we're going to have a warm engine and we're going to check the engine oil level all right in order to check the oil on your convertible you're going to have to open this lid so the way to do that is you press the lock button one two hold it down on the second bang now your lid is up you know the coupe obviously has the exposed engine and everything is right there readily available for you but on the convertible you have to hit the lock button once hit the unlock well hit the convertible button twice hold it down on the second time right here this is where we want to go in and see our dipstick there you go pull that cover back tells you right there what type of oil but we want to see if our engine oil is low. Uh, on the dipstick, it tells you that the, the, the car should be at idle and your engine should be warm. So the car is not running right now. I just want to just take a look at what it looks like since I just backed it out of the garage. So it will be indicating low 
currently. I don't know how good you can see that or not. But we're gonna do as it says on the dipstick. It says check with warm engine and running at idle. Check with warm engine and running at idle is what it says on the dipstick. Let me see if y'all can see that. I'm gonna try to. So let's try to start the car. Let's try to start the car with the lid up and see how that works out. The engine is definitely warm. Let's see what it looks like now. The level is definitely higher than before, it's at level. Let's take one more look. Take one more look. Let's take one more look while we're at idle. Yeah, we're at level. We're at the highest little, the little open dot. We're definitely there. So, with that being the case, the, the engine oil is not low. But with that light coming on, it's definitely saying, hey, within 600 miles, we need to go ahead and schedule our oil change. Let's close our cover back down. Make sure that's sealed. Definitely don't want any water to get in there. Now, to close the lid back down, we're going to have to, we had to cut the car off. Definitely had to cut the car off because these controls would not work. Putting the top back up, there's no way you can put the top back up with the car running or with the car not running. The remote is only giving you the ability to take the top down by hitting unlock, pressing the convertible opener three times and holding. That'll bring the whole roof back and you'll be in the convertible mode. But for oil change or maintenance purposes, you want to just hit the lock button one time and hold the convertible button down twice. But let's just see what happens if we do it while the car's running. Lock, one, two, let's see if it'll close it. Nope. So let's hop in. And as you can see, it says top not secure. It definitely should say that. Close it down. Our check engine oil message is still on here. And what I'm definitely going to do is hit schedule service, but let's close our lid down. And of course, you could definitely call your local dealership, but why not use the Chevrolet app, whether you're doing it from your phone or you're just getting inside your car, you can do a quick request for service. It even tells you when the next available appointments are. I think that's pretty cool. So I go to Hendrick Chevrolet in Cary, North Carolina. That's my my dealership trevor buck is my salesperson sales associate uh corvette guy corvette dude and um yeah hit him up that's for trevor buck at uh hendrick chevrolet man he took good care of me when i ordered my corvette man and milos also milos really really good guy over there at hendrick chevrolet so i'm gonna take care of this uh request i gotta check my calendar to see um what time um, it's best for me because they, they have a Thursday appointment, but I can hit this little pencil right here and you can see the other appointments that they have available different days of the week. I think I might just go ahead and lock in um, a Monday appointment. 9 a.m. Got all these different times. I prefer the morning so I can get in and get out. So let's lock in a 9 a.m. oil change appointment. and send a request. It's done. Your appointment has been scheduled. Look how easy that was. So we wanna play around with the engine oil. So I did I did make sure that it wasn't low because if it was low, I was prepared to replace you know, the oil that um, to get it back up to the proper level. You definitely wanna be riding around with low oil in these high performing cars. Or any car, as a matter of fact. The only car you wanna ride around in with no oil in it is a Tesla. So that's it for this video, man.
Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe, man, for more C8 content. It's on the way.